Welcome back to Warplan, where it's all gone a little bit wrong for Germany. Although it should be said, the Allies are taking heavy casualties, because you know, Hungary may have surrendered, but apparently Germany is not going to surrender until you wipe everybody out. Germany has got a large army, they're just trapped in Dusseldorf and Cologne. They're basically penned in on the Rhine. I have no idea where getting their supplies. They still have Denmark. That should probably be on the Allies list to recover. Ooh, escorts. And the Soviet Union is just building up more forces as we speak. Most of everyone's kind of upgrades are going into uh, repairs. Oh, the Americans have got a load more. Across a few more infantry corps. So, let's start with the official war first. The weather's bad because we're hitting it's October, late October. We may just have to murder a few of these outside units and then uh, have a recovery. Because we do need a recovery. Probably not the time to be invading Yugoslavia. Huh. That's a tough part of that unit. That dog in well. So yes, we, it looks like we're mostly um, digging in and recovering, which is fine by me. At this point, you know, we're just waiting for Germany to wave on the vine. No worries, I just moved it like quite a weak unit onto the front there. Yeah, movement's not going to happen much this turn. Guard are still entrenched. Is it the Americans or the French? The Americans had some special points, like some heavy artillery. And the French also could do with some heavy artillery. Because that's the type of war we're fighting. And the snow hits. And more, the partisans move. Wouldn't surprise me that's the worst thing that happens to me. Desperately needs a merchant marine. Did you run out of shipyards? Okay. Well, it's improved, so we should start or we'll continue to reduce this guy down. He's taking, we've got to take a few 
few hits before we can go down, is he? Oh, he is dropping quite well. I should probably also bomb this guy. And this guy here. Probably getting air support from somewhere. Taking this guy out is kind of quite useful. Exactly what we need. Can't embark them instead, apparently. That's a shame. Alright, so we shall go. War panel. Soviet Union. Yugoslavia. Declare one Yugoslavia. Starman units will drive forwards. Zagreb will fall. And again, the main issue is getting enough troops into position. I'm going to start forming up nicely on the border of Italy, ready for another minor war. Yes, I know. Sorry, kind of just chirped at me. I'll we'll start forming up on the Romanian, Romanian border. Yeah. 
Map projections are weird. if you live on the south you know, in the Balkans, haven't you? Yugoslavia has fallen in the first month. I feel like just taking more and more of this will help. You're all going to become Soviet. Let's go to Yugoslavia, go for that. Oh great falls next turn no matter what. to the board. You know you're being overconfident when you're you're invading somewhere like Yugoslavia in the winter. Buggery and then halfway back. Oh, 
Alright, you need weakening before the attack. Continuing the policy of just picking off the odd German unit. I'll keep this guy weakened. I should I like how she's looking pretty nasty now though. Across, don't work. Approve his move. Do we need the second home guard over there? We need the second home guard over here, don't we? Americans have got a metric ton of guys who need loading up. down to this border here. Ready for what will be the most fun invasion. Italy. and that's another turn of war plan. So yeah, this war is actually over and it's just the AI being a bit stubborn. So now it's just how much of the uh, the Balkans can we eat up. Just playing for fun now.